But Christine got more of her uh, restoration parts. We can fabricate just about anything, but some things are, are just, they're just not worth, worth messing with. This inner rocker, this inner rocker isn't a real complicated piece, but, um, but it, it has bends on it that has a lip at the bottom to, uh, to weld to the uh, outer rocker. And then it has like a, it's basically just a piece of channel iron with a, with a uh, lip on the bottom. But how much was it? 35, 40 bucks, something like that? Yeah, 40, 50, I think. I mean, 30. You're not gonna get a lot. I think it was 31. Yeah, so even if everything went well and you fabricated it in, in an hour, and time, time is money. So if the part's available and it seems to be a, a nice fit, we just went ahead and, uh, and bought the piece. So, I'll show you that. So yeah, basically all this is, is, is like I said, a channel, and then it has this at the bottom, which will weld to here. So this will be the first piece to go up there. I, I just marked this. We'll notch this out, and that'll bring this panel one rib this way, and get us up on top of here. And then that'll weld to here. That'll weld to the top of there when we're that to here. Whether that is how it was originally or not, I'm not sure, but uh, man, it sure fits nice there. And that's how we're gonna do it. Yeah, and it sort it sort of looks like this rib will sit right on top of here. Mm -hmm. So, so let's get after it. Let's. Uh, Cut those out quick. You can tell that Christine's getting used to being around the grinder. Mm -hmm. She knows which way the sparks are going to hit her from. Yep, especially after that one hit my lip. Right, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who could forget that? Oh yeah. All right. Let's get in there with that one. this away a little bit too to get it a little bit further out. We're not quite reaching where we want to be. And I think we want to be right on top of this. So we'll just notch here and here. Nothing on the back side. Is that going to cover up this bow? We'll end up notching around there oh, too, I think. Okay. So we got to mark that out. But like I said, again, yeah, I don't know that that's how, mm -hmm. that's how it goes, but that's definitely how we're doing it. face.
this off over here. That's how we want it. And there isn't anything that really connects these two together on the top. So we're sort of relying on, on the weld that's in here and the weld that's out here to keep these from, you know, although this is a pretty, pretty serious piece of metal doubled up like that. So what we'll do is we'll attack that inner rocker in and then we'll just try this from time to time to make sure that we're that we still fit nice. I think the bottom of that inner rocker is out a little bit. Just a little just a little. Might be even up a little bit. Yeah, we're not we're not trying to get this. We're not trying to win awards here. We're trying to get it on the on the road. That is really close. Mm -hmm. And it appears we're touching pretty much everywhere on our floor braces. And our outriggers, even though someone told us they're not outriggers. Yeah, we're good, huh? Mm -hmm. Piece of cake. So this one might be I think the end of this is down a little bit. See that? These ones are sort of under it. So I think that, you want that? The, the, the rubber, the rubber mallet, yeah. Let's see if I can just power it up a little bit. Yep, that's what it took. Like that. You know, this, this might end up butted here now, which is fine too. You know, we have, we've got a, so long as we're not a, a full rib off, we can splice it in pretty much wherever we want over there. And even if, even if we were a full rib off, that, this thing's gonna get carpet under there. Mm -hmm. Let's just see how far we are. This test fit things a thousand times, but and I think we're right on. We'll cut that away, leave whatever good metal we can. And there's gonna be some spots like way down in the corner here. It's all rust treated and everything. And it's welded. Uh, we'll end up just, well maybe, maybe add a little bit more weld there to make sure it's gonna be strong and then, then we'll just put seam sealer in it. 
this is sticking out just a little so that's why we're tight over here so yeah let's just make sure we have that front end of that uh, inner rocker up and we'll start tacking it How in the hell did we get that out of there? Like that? You wedged it in there pretty good. All right. Oh, this was up. That's what it is. Yep. So we got pretty good. Uh, a bit smarter to mark them when when I had it in there. Not much of a thinker. You don't think good. Yeah, I don't think good. <laughs> so that's where we gotta go there. Uh, here and here. Here and here. Here and here. Then back here they're a little bit wider, so you see these are these are a tad bit wider where they weld on. So we gotta grind them out a little bit further. I'm just gonna do it with this since it's right here right now. Mm -hmm. I would be very careful with cutting discs doing this. It's, I mean, don't do it. That's Disclaimer on our video. Yeah. Got a little bit here that we should get out of the way. before yes, that breaks off and, and something bad happens.
All right. Did I do that backward? Mm -hmm. Why didn't you stop me? What a dumbass. Okay. No. You gotta flip it around. There you go. So I was right the first time or I wasn't or? I don't know. Or who cares? Right. Maybe I'm gonna get that, that edge right now too since. Okay. Since it's super easy right now. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I'll go the whole way though because I want to keep some some uh, some of the primer on it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No, what I'm gonna do, what I'm gonna do is drill this, and then we'll we'll plug weld onto here from the back. That way we don't have anything to finish on the front. Okay. And I could do that once it's on there. Yeah. Yeah. All greasy and grimy. And maybe that bar. So this is out just a little bit too far. So we'll bend it back and then once we're in there we can straighten it back out. Mm -hmm. We'll leave it like that for right now. Maybe get this one too. smooth if I wouldn't pinch my finger every time I do that. <laughs> okay, spice grips. If you're gonna be dumb, you gotta be tough. That's right. What a nice panel. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 30 bucks is worth it. <laughs> yeah. So I'll lift it up. And if anyone is wondering where we're getting the, the panels from, it's Wolfsburg West. Very nice quality. I don't think we're gonna do any more than that. I think we, I think I grabbed a welder and, yeah. and get after it. I might end up cutting I might end up cutting this top off so we're more flush. You know, pound this I think down. So. And I think pretty, it would be we're pretty, fine. We're pretty flush here. I think it's gonna end up falling in one of the rivers. Yeah, it probably ways. it probably will, right? Yeah. Alright. 
Just adds a little more support. You talked me out of it. Yeah. As she often does. Mm-hmm. Wire speed or what? Yeah. I'm gonna try going back here. Still a little more than I care for. It's always nice to have a panel there to redirect the sparks to your face. Mm -hmm. That one's laid flat enough. I don't think we're going to worry about it. Yeah, that one looks really good. Okay, yeah. so we'll go every six inches or so and we'll drill a hole. And then we'll clean the back of this here. And that's where we'll, that's where we'll do our spot welding. Spot welds here just because it's kind of a spot where there's a lot of there's a lot of twist going on here with the door. Mm -hmm. So we'll probably put three in this small, small area. We'll do the same thing there where the latch is gonna be. Should put my hand on something that's super hot. It's a good time. Mm -hmm. Two at the end here. Uh, what's going on here? I thought it was against something. Okay, so let's hold that up there. Hold it and then I go underneath and mark it. Uh, I think I could put that, that clamp back on it right now. Yeah, that's true. The sag on this end. Mm -hmm. Not a big deal. We can mess with that later. What we'll do is get this up to where we want it, clamp it, and then we'll shut the doors. See what they look like for to see if we're what, where we want to be. And that looks awful close, right? Oh yeah. This it's guy. not going to be perfect, but... Right, because it's sitting down. 
There's a hand. That one's perfect, actually. That's almost right where the hinge is supposed to be. Yeah, so this door will end up coming up just the hair once yeah. we're adjusted, or once we have the... So that's... I think we're good on. there. Yeah. Dead on balls accurate. Dead on balls accurate. So, come in here. Man, I gotta go underneath there, don't I? Here. I'm glad we bought that light. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that was a good investment. I don't think my marker fits through the hole, so we'll just mark the, the spots. Why didn't I put one here? I thought you did. No, there's no hole in the... You sure? Well, I sure don't see one. <laughs> That's where you put one there. It's no, one right there. Huh. Okay. So we'll drill that hole. And again, before we get ahead of ourselves, we'll lay that, lay that floor panel down. Cause I really like how all of that fits. But the panel needs to like how it fits. Mm -hmm. Yeesh. You're pretty good at this, Christina. Mm -hmm. Man, I think that's all perfect. I think it is too. I don't think it'd be any better. Really. Yeah, so long as we're straight this way, and it sure appeared that way when we had the door shut. Mm-hmm. And when these have all these different bends in there, it's hard to make them anything but straight. Right. But straight. <laughs> okay, Beavis. Okay, well, I'm gonna get underneath there and burn the living shit out of myself. Weld some plugs. Yeah, so you guys could go ahead and watch this towel start on fire with me on top of it. It's gonna be a good time. Well, that's right there. Probably could use that. Huh? By your feet. It's just so tall, though. Oh. Oh yeah, I was like, where the hell is that light? It's under the hood of the Cuda. <laughs> is it charged? Yeah. No. Oh, maybe. Lights up for like two seconds. Mm-hmm. Okay. Moving right along. My belly.
My tape's still down there. Yeah. I was like, what in the heck is going on down here? Yep. I figured it out. Mm hmm. Figured out what you're doing. Okay. Oh, damn it. That light's done already. My head was burning a little bit there. Yeah, that little, that little ridge that's in there is sort of in our way, but. Ooh, there's my belly again. Did I burn through? Is there a hole out here? Mm, a little bit of one, but not bad. Okay, we can we can live without, I guess. Yeah. Fire extinguishers in the gas, are right? Yes, there's a fire extinguisher <laughs> in the gas. Here. Take it. Mm -hmm. I don't think there's a hole there. No, it was over. Right there. I still don't see a hole, but it's... I think it's fine. I think it's fine, too. We might have just looked that way when it was still hot. Yeah, we're definitely uh, down a little bit in the middle. But it's good enough for me if it's good enough for you. Mm -hmm. So that's all there as good as we can get it for right now. Now we will, we gotta put our holes in here to plug weld through here. And you already have them marked out, right? No. Yeah, on the top. So, on each line in each valley, like this, like this, not like that, like that. Okay. Um, I'll get another drill and we'll. Just both have at it, right? Yeah. Okay. Where's our safety enforcer? That's the problem, he's not here. <laughs> Okay. 
Do you want your welding this? Do you want me to sit on it to kind of push it together? I'll probably have you take a hammer handle and push down next to the weld. Okay. Let's get this cut up a little bit. You'll take a hammer handle. Okay. Push with everything you got right there. And then we'll move to that one. Okay, I'll climb in and I'll do okay. from outside. Yeah. 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 That thing works so good. Yeah, it's pretty sweet. Mm -hmm. It's pretty swass. Oh, yeah. Okay. Game over. That's how it's done, son. A little bit pull this way. Here we go. Yeah. Okay. Start right here. And then we'll probably keep moving this way. We'll do this whole middle roll first. I don't know if that's right or not, but okay. that's what we're going to do. Otherwise, they're ugly. They're going to be hard to grind anyway. Okay, right. you can let well, it go. Well, it's, it's going to be covered anyway. I know, but I still don't like it ugly. I know. Right here. A lot of rust there. Right in the crotch. Yep. <laughs> right in the old crotch. Mm -hmm. 
Well, these are down, so I'm going to do those. They're already down. They are? Okay. bit down there. I don't know if they're gonna be hard to grind or not. They might not be. I should grind a couple just to see. Cause maybe I can adjust my weld some. That's about right. It's not so bad. Mm -mm. This I'll probably have to recut from here on because it seems like it's that way a bit. I don't know if we should have more heat in it or we'll just keep going. These last few are better than the first few, so mm -hmm. I'm push down here. Is that all you got? Be a pussy. There you go. Okay, you can let go. not anybody I can see that. Ooh, that's a good one. Mm -hmm. really all it takes. Cooking with fire now. Mm -hmm. I just pound them down then. Does wonders. dance easily.
Can you imagine getting into a head on collision with one of these things? No. It's funny you should bring it up though with your driving skills. Mm-hmm. No, that's what I was just thinking. I'm like, hmm. You were thinking, huh, this is it. Yeah. Building my own casket, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Well, don't take me with you. Oh, I don't okay. want to go. That one was perfect. I don't want to go either, but sometimes when it's your time to go, it's your time to go. When it's your time to go, sometimes you ride with Christina. <laughs> yeah. With the Grim Reaper. <laughs> So the back side of that was supposed to have a brace on it, mm -hmm. but we could go from underneath and cap it. Yeah. Or I could just hit it with some welds on the tops and then we could seam seal it. You can do that. That would work. That would work too. Mm-hmm. Are you going to be able to weld that, you think, once we're... I think so. Nice thing is that if, if, if it doesn't look that good, you just grind it, right? Because it's way up on top. It doesn't have to be purdy. Right. Grind this, huh? Yeah, probably. It won't even, I don't know. It seems like it, it's pretty good, right? Mm -hmm. yeah, I don't think I do anything. Let's see if we pound it down. Wow. I think it's coming right. In. Can't ask for a better fit than that. Okay. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah, that'll be you. Next time you're here, you can grind the welds, mm -hmm. and uh, and then you can go that full distance. Yeah. And then we'll make a little patch panel here. Right there, yeah. Little one there. Yeah. And then the floor is done. Well, this side. Yeah. Up there, but. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Awesome. That was a killer hour. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. Mm -hmm.